Hi guys and welcome back to another Minecraft tutorial. So we've got another one of these Aztec fantasy type Aztec uh, style houses. Um, this one's a little bit bigger than the last one or, or number one, but still pretty, pretty cool. Um, I kind of used this design in my Aztec series as well. It, it's just kind of cool and very, very simple. It's based off the Age of Empires uh, type Aztec buildings. But what we're going to do guys is we're going to switch over to the default texture pack and get started on this one. Okay, so here we are in the default texture pack. So, materials we're going to need stone slab, cobblestone, uh, chiseled stone bricks, cobblestone stairs, cobblestone slab, hay bale, cobblestone wall, and stone for some variation type stuff. So, it's really, really simple this one, guys. What we're going to do, we're going to start with the side. We go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and that's with your slabs. Then double up on that. Okay. Now, at the front, what we're going to do, I think it happens straight away. It does, yeah. Straight away we go for the entrance, so we get a double one here, leave a gap, double one there. Then we go down back one, right? So it's just the entrance is just sticking out a little bit. And then we go one, two, three, uh, four even. And then we're going to have this as a pillar. So we go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, leave two. Like that. So we start getting pillars around. And then we're going to have this one going up block up then we do the same here one two three like that okay then we're gonna go around to the side I'm gonna go one two oops three make a pillar and again here two and the pillar and across the back we just for the time being we just build the base like this we're gonna have two block gap here and then the pillar two block gap here and then a pillar and that'll mean we get a three block gap here then we're going to just put in cobblestone on the lower part of it. Like that. And also what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to start variating it as well. So we get like these bits where there isn't like this, this perfect thing. It's not going to be completely perfect because we don't want it to be perfect. <laughs> we also don't want to do stuff like that though. So we get like walls like this and we can put in some like stone or whatever. Um, to variate it and I think it's andesite I mean 1.7 for this because this is what they've made in there we go so you can get stuff like that then if you put your chiseled stone brick on top in these middle bits like that grab your stone stairs and put them upside down on each of these kind of like pillar type things obviously we've deleted some of them uh, we get pillars like here so downstairs so downstairs one there even on there even though it doesn't look like it and there this one here and my mouse is double clicking. There we go. Right. Then on top of these, we just do normal stairs. So this is depending on the direction that they're upside down, will be the direction that they're the right way up. That makes sense. Should do. So we're going to get that there, and then this one's going that way. Okay. Then what we do is grab our hay bales and we just put them in behind. I'm not going to variate my hay bales. I, I quite like them looking like this. Uh, I don't know why. I just do. Put that in there. Now I can't remember what I did. I did it just flat. So just this bit here. So I just do flat like that. And then what we're going to do is going to go uh, up another level. So what we could do for now is put in some stone. It's going to round this bit. Just to make it easier for me to place stuff down. And then I'm going to place them down like this. You can completely, you know, vary the different directions that they have and, and do stuff like this where you get. You know, really, really varied roofs. Um, I don't know why I like it like this. I, I just do in in default. In Conquest, I don't like it. <laughs> but in default, I like it like this really well-ordered thing. I just have it messy down here instead. I don't know why. It's weird, but it's completely up to you guys, really. There we go. Get that. Then what we're going to do is going to have stone slabs above this. And it'll go around top. Oops, there we go. And right to there. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go down it in. And we're going to just place down any block for now and put in some cobblestone slabs. Like that. And that will just create it a, a little dip type thing. Then with your uh, cobblestone slab, we're just going to put it on top of here. And these ones, I don't think we do those ones. No, we don't. We do that one there and then that one there. And these ones. And these ones. Pretty much just all linking in like that. 
and then grab your cobblestone wall and wherever we've got the stairs we shove in cobblestone wall obviously you can put in your mossy as well and you can really you can vary this uh, as you do any normal build you know like this you could put in some mossy and andesite and all that kind of stuff and put in some stone bricks maybe instead of using this and you know you can do your usual variations and also don't forget about that <laughs> put in one there then what you're going to do is put your cobblestone uh, slabs in on these bits here um, you can use like wood as well spruce wood looks pretty cool I think so I'm going to put in those there like that and then obviously you can put your stone buttons on as well if you want to just completely button it up um, but that is it for the tutorial it is that easy nice and simple uh, hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one.